What's, What's good, good TJ? TJ? We're back for one final show before we go on break. I sure am hyped for that. I bet. By the way, that insane intro is by Bree L. Let's chat about the resume building workshop one last time. At some point in your life, you'll need a resume. Now is a great time to learn. Head over to room 111 today at lunch for the workshop. Lunch is provided. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Sounds like I'll be there. Same. Now let's hear from Sports and News. Bonjour, buenos noches, and good morning. Welcome back to the Spartan Edition on this final day before break. In Denver sports news, the Denver Nuggets are playing the Philadelphia 76ers tonight. The 9-5 Nuggets look to hold off the 8-7 Sixers at home. I'm rooting for my favorite team. Yeah, go Nuggets, right? What, what are you talking about? The Sixers, you pinhead. Anyway, stemming from the football world, the New England Patriots are playing the Atlanta Falcons tonight, a rematch of Super Bowl 51. That is wild. Let's see if the Falcons can hold a lead this time. Probably not. The Falcons suck. Anyway. Well, TJ, that is all the sports that we have to cover today. Are you doing anything this break, Red Juan? Going to school. All right. We'll see you after the break, TJ. Are you excited about winter sports? Yeah, of course I am. It's winter. Are you excited about winter sports? Yeah, I got one. Yeah, I've been looking forward to basketball for a while, so I'm excited. <laughs> Are you excited about winter sports? Yes. Are you excited about winter sports? Oh yeah, I'm ecstatic. Hey TJ. Welcome to the news. We've got a short one, but a good one for you today. In Spider-Man news, Andrew Garfield's new film Tick Tick Boom comes out on Netflix tonight. Directed by Lin-Manuel Miranda, Garfield stars as a musical theater composer trying to make it. Only if he made it into the Spider-Man trailer. Yeah. Anyways, Elon Musk's company will attempt to launch its futuristic bullet-shaped starship to orbit in January. He does not believe that it will be a successful first test flight. Well, that's all I got for you for the week, TJ. See, See you around. around. Thanks, guys. You're the best. So informative. I'd like to be informative about the TJ Art Show. Yeah. <laughs> Art and ceramic students work will be on display during December 7th through the 9th. The show runs from 4.30 to 6.30 p.m. Show up, TJ! Be there. Now let's finish off the show with a word from some clubs in Aden. Catch you later, TJ. Good morning, TJ. Mr. Kristoff here, your favorite principal. How's it going, TJ? Hey, uh, I want to say congratulations to all of our juniors who took the AccuPlace for this week. You guys crushed it. Teachers, excellent job. This is a testament to all the juniors on their hard work and teachers, your amazing work in the classroom, especially over these last three years. It's been crazy. Uh, overall, 83% of our uh, juniors tested college ready in English and 82% of them tested college ready in math. That's phenomenal. Probably the best in the district. Maybe the best in the state. Maybe the best in the country. Crushing it guys, keep it up, you're doing amazing work. I want everybody to have a happy and safe Thanksgiving break. We got 10 days off, no school tomorrow. Have a great time, get some rest, get some sleep, get caught up on some work, and I'll see you guys in 10 days. Christoph out. Hey TJ, uh, this is Mr. Anderson. I guess, I guess two messages right now. One of them, um, you made it to Thanksgiving break. Congratulations, I hope you guys get a chance to just relax get mind off school for a little bit, um, take some time for yourselves. But also, for those of you that are a little behind in classes or missing work or whatever, use this time to your advantage. You got 10 days with nothing new coming in. Get caught up so that the last three weeks when we get back is easy and you can just basically just coast till the end. Kinda, except for finals. Don't coast through finals. Um, but anyway, enjoy your break. We'll see you when you get back. I'm out. All right, TJ. Just a reminder that student leadership is doing hygiene kits to help out homeless and other people in need. And so how we're doing it is freshmen bring in deodorant, any deodorant that you can donate, obviously not used. Uh, sophomores bring in socks, juniors bring toothbrushes and toothpaste, and seniors bring hand sanitizer. The drop-off days are December 4th and 6th. See you there. What's up, TJ? It's Ben again, Latino Club here. We will be selling uh, snacks after school, the usual, nachos for $2 and everything else. It's gonna be a five-star buffet, so be there, TJ. Gourmet buffet. All right, cool. Perfect. Good job, guys. Awesome. Thank you. Appreciate it. Yeah. 
Hey TJ, it's Evan from Skills USA. Just wanted to come on here today to thank all of you guys for the donations for our Thanksgiving food drive the past three weeks. Also, it's not too late to join Skills USA. The deadline for joining is December 10th when we get back from break. So if you're still interested in it, go to the Google Classroom and fill out the forms. Again, the deadline is December 10th, so be sure to sign up. That's all I have today. Have a great Thanksgiving, TJ. This is actually my first year at TJ, so very exciting. My favorite thing about TJ is definitely the diversity and how close-knit the community is. Because of the diversity, I really wanted to work at a school with students from all different backgrounds and all different walks of life. and. I really wanted to teach anatomy and they had an opening for that. Oof, don't think so. There's so many great people, it's hard to choose. Um, what do I find unique about TJ? Um, I think that it's a big school but it has a small feel still, which is good. Hey Juliana. Are you excited for Thanksgiving break? Yeah, but I have a big test after, so I'm kind of nervous. Uh, well, maybe if you pull the wishbone and you win, you'll have good luck. What's your name? Oliver. Okay, the question is, if you had a million dollars, what's the first thing you would buy? I would go to Europe. Why? Because it's pretty cool. Cool, thanks. What's your name? Cyrus. Okay, Cyrus, if you had a million dollars, what's the first thing you would buy? Some flamingos. Some flamingos? Yeah. Why? Why not? Yeah. I like the answer. Thank you. Who am I here with? Sam. Sam, if you had a million dollars, what would you buy? I would buy a bunch of sports cars. Why? Because I like cars. Thank you. What's your name? Kalim. Alright, the question is, if you had a million dollars, what's the first thing you would buy? Um, a huge house for my mama. Why? Because I love her, obviously. Thank you. Yeah.